All right, kiddos, this week's nonfiction book, Fly Guy presents Bats. And again, it's by Ted Arnold. Let's read all about bats. Buzz and Fly Guy went to the nocturnal house at the zoo. Buzz looked at the map. They were inside a bat cave. Bats are so cool, said Buzz. But I don't know much about them. Buzz and Fly Guy wanted to learn more. Bats. Almost all bats are nocturnal. That means they are active at night and sleep during the day. Other animals such as raccoons and barn owls are also mainly nocturnal. Bats hang upside down to sleep. They hang in high places to be safe from hunting animals. Some bats hang from trees or under bridges. Bats might even hang out in your attic. Other bats live in caves. They hang from the ceiling. A group of bats is called a colony. Some colonies in caves have more than 20 million, 20 million bats. Three, uh, there are more than 1,200, so 1,200 different species or kinds of bats. The most common bat in North America is the little brown bat. Bats live on every continent except for Antarctica. Antarctica. They can be found as far north as the Arctic Circle, where temperatures can dip as low as negative 30 degrees Fahrenheit. They also live in very hot places like Death Valley, California, where the temperature once reached 134 degrees Fahrenheit. Bats are mammals. Mammals have fur and they are warm blooded. That means that the temperature of their body does not change with the temperature of where they live. Are. Bats are the only mammal in the world that can fly. Right here, Fly Guy's like, I flies. Yes, but you are not a mammal. You are an insect. Flying is hard work. Bats use gravity uh, or the force that pulls objects downward the, uh, to Earth to help them take off. First, Bats hang upside down. Next, they drop from their perch and flap their wings until they are flying through the air. Most bats are small and weigh less than two ounces. That is less than an orange. Kitty's hog nose bat, also called the bumblebee bat, is the world's smallest bat. It is only about one inch long. Can you show me one inch? About that, right? Hmm. And then there are some large bats too. The greater flying fox bat is the largest bat in the world. From tip to tip, its wings stretch to about five feet. Different kinds of bat eat different things. Many bats, such as the Egyptian slit face bat, eat insects. Some insects, some insect eating bats are uh, also eat frogs, lizards, small birds, and even fish. Wow. Fruit bats munch on fruits and drink nectar from flowers. Vampire bats eat only blood. They drink from other animals, such as cattle. These bats use uh, heat sensors to help them find the animal they are hunting. Some of them look scary. Like, see this one? This is a vampire bat, right? Yeah, vampire bat. It looks kind of scary. Bats have amazing bodies. These small mammals have two wings, two legs, and a tail. 
They cannot run because their legs are too small, and their wings are not as strong as birds. Bats have two thumbs, one at each wrist. These thumbs help them to climb, fight, and hunt. Let me show you that picture first. This one, and then that's the picture of their, um, I think of their thumbs. All bats have teeth. Fruit-eating bats have uh, simpler teeth than bats that eat insect. Insect-eating bats have sharper teeth that help them crush the insects. Vampire bats have razor-sharp teeth. Bats have super sense. Some bats can see really well in the dark. Bats, bats nose, uh, noses have extra special smell sensors. And bats have great hearing. They can hear an insect's beating wings. Wow. That's like super hearing. Many type of bats use a special sound to get around and to find food. This is called echolocation. Bats send their sound out from their nose or mouth. The sound travels to an object, bounces off of it and travels back to the bat's ear. This lets the bat know how far away the object is so the bat can locate it. Bat sounds are too high pitched for people to hear. Some bats make sounds louder than 110 decibels. Not all bats hunt the same way. Some bats, like the um, diadem round leaf bat, wait for an insect to fly by. Then they fly after the insect to catch it. Okay. Other bats hunt as a group. They help one another catch prey. Many bats hibernate in the winter when there is not much food. They go into a deep sleep. Then when spring comes, the bat wakes up to hunt again. Most female bats give birth to only one baby each year. Baby bats are called pups. All pups, even baby vampire bats, drink milk from their mother. Baby bats hang on their mothers. A mother bat recognizes her pup's scent and cry. Even with hundreds of pups in one colony, mom can always find her baby. Chiro, uh, chiropterologists okay, are scientists who study bats. They try to learn more about bats. In 2013, scientists discover a new species of disc wean bat. These bats um, have discs on their thumbs that help them to climb. Hmm, this one looks interesting here. Look. Wow. Bats are amazing, said Buzz. From now on, I promise to never try to swat a bat, even if one gets in my house. I will get help to safely remove it. Bats are our friends. Buzz and Fly Guy couldn't wait for their next adventure. All right. I hope you like that bat. See you next time. Bye.